What's up guys, Dr. Drew here. We're gonna go through three types of terrible postures you can have in the car, okay? Number one is that lowrider gangster look where you're gonna have your right hip kind of shifted, arm here, you're gonna be bumping to that music. All right, maybe give a little finger to this guy cutting you off. Terrible posture, okay? That's gonna put a tremendous stress on this right hip, especially hitting that gas pedal and brake with the right foot. Terrible. Next thing we see is the classic grandma or new driver look, okay? So that's where we're gonna be super hunched, we're stressed out, what's going on? Arms are super tight, our arch is back. Don't want that, that's gonna put stress on the lower back. Last one, super kind of just chill, side to side, hanging out, not really knowing what's going on, right? We don't want that, let's drive safe, let's go through it properly. So three things you need to do. First is we gotta keep the legs at 90 degrees. You shouldn't be arched back. So what you wanna do, is bring that seat back, start a little bit farther, okay? Make sure these legs are at 90 degrees from your feet all the way down from the knee to the hip. Once that's like that, as you can see, this seat is way too far back. So we gotta bring this up. Bring it up nice and easy, just like this. It should be comfortable. You shouldn't feel like you're inside of the steering wheel. You want it to be nice and easy, just like this. And then again, you wanna have obviously your hands at 10 and two, all right, basic, simple stuff, just like this. And you shouldn't have to lean back. A lot of people think, oh, I gotta lean back in the car, no. You wanna to try to keep those shoulder blades tight, just like this. And it's okay if you wanna have one hand up here, one down here, whatever's more comfortable. But again, you gotta engage your core. You gotta do these things. It's, you're tired, obviously you're gonna slouch and you're gonna have that poor posture. Don't get me wrong, I do it too, but we gotta be in habits of how to properly eliminate this stuff. That way you're not in my office in pain. Does that make sense? If you have any other questions or concerns, give our office a call. We'd love to hear from you.